Welcome back to Dark Souls 2, everybody. I'm Nietzsche. I'm Dr. Tempest. They are going to be playing Skull or the First Sin. We're still in uh, Broom Tower. Yeah, we're going to be starting Iron Passage here pretty soon. Probably, maybe. Probably. Maybe. There's so much to do in this zone. I love it. It is. It feels like this DLC, even though it's only a single zone, it feels more involved to me than um, the linear passage of the... For the DLC in Dark Souls 1. So, where are my souls at? For one, we spin the thing right round. It's on fire, it's stuck on doors. Like a record, baby. I don't think records get stuck on doors. Sure do. I wish I was this style in profile in real life. Yeah. That's what they all say. Nice! It's kind of a casual walk on. Uh, you're looking the wrong way. Yep, left. Where's your soul? Yay! Frickin' dude had some weenies today! <laughs> he sure did. That is one thing, I feel like they should have done the... I feel like you can just cheese the fuck out of him, because he doesn't want to go past this doorway. You know? Yeah. Just repeatedly hit him right when he's in the doorway. Okay, so do you notice how his, like, chest exploded in yellow? Right before he swung? I wonder if that means that that's his... Like, see? He just exploded in yellow? Is he gonna... Yes! That's a tell to let you know that he's about to spew fire when he swims. Huh. Data point of two. Hundred percent accuracy. Hmm. Open that one. But... Open the one with the fire behind it. That sounds like a bad idea. Well, give me the controller and I'll do it. No! What's behind door number four? Not fire. Go back. Wait, go back. Hold on. One of these. S stick it with the smelter. Right. right. Hidden mm -hmm. path ahead makes sense because if you look to your right. See? Oh, look at you being clever. That's what I thought it was. I thought there was something behind the box. Now go back out there. Go back out the one that's already open. Back to door three. Why? To see if there's something. Another ledge here. Nope. Okay. You can see there's. Wait, wait, wait. Look down. Uh, look over to the. Look, look. No. Not that way. The other way. I saw what looked like a left. See that giant ass? Okay, that's a chain. That's somewhere we're going soon. Yeah. I wonder which direction we'll approach it from. Down. <laughs> Tight night shard 10. Petrify. Well, seven broadsword. Fuck it. Here's some things. Try out some new weapons, guys. Uh -huh. uh, We've been there. But yes, what? we have been there. That box. Yeah, this looks like... That's where we fought the one assassin dude. Right. So there's the stairs, so... Yeah, it looks like there's a way to bounce around that. Like, see if... Hold on a second. I'm curious. Uh, see if there's a hidden door right there. Sure. Where is... Okay, we've got two smelter weapons. Which means there's two of those idols that we haven't found. Did you... One we haven't found. Did you activate the one at the very first bonfire? No. I swear we skipped one too. Okay, we want to go further um, counterclockwise around this tower if we can. We want to go further that way, yeah. Because that's the way to a little platform that we haven't had access to yet, I think. We might have to go up more to get to it. Mm -hmm. Or down more, maybe? Not we also haven't been on this elevator. It's never worked. Oh, well, then let's try it. What's the worst thing happened? Did you really? Did you really just say that? It's 
split up, gang. Shut your mouth. You know, I think now that I'm all alone, we can make a big shower. What? This place can't be haunted. Snuff films do not exist. Oh, what's that design on the door? Uh, I don't know the thing. Go to the right, not the door, the wall behind you. Excellent. Jerk! <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Did you see him? No. But they, that, that worked out amazingly. There seriously is a design on the get though. It might just be a random texture. But on the wall. Is it just here? Yeah, these guys look like Sun Bro. A little bit. Mostly because of their helmet. Why did Sun Bro turn into mini bros? Rather multiple bros. And then become violent. Why would he do this to a bro? So I know we can just go this way. Because we're on the same level. And there's the thingy. This place is convoluted. Yeah, it's like... Oh, hey, door. This wasn't the way. Oh, it was the way. Which way? Let's go across. Okay, what's in the door that you saw? I will as soon as I get the souls. I possibly kill the thing in the next one. actually move the camera onto the wall because I thought I saw a cool design, but I think it was just random texture. And it's unimportant. Charge your laser. I've gotten so good at killing these things. Like the disparity in your skill level is amazing at times. I don't get it. I really don't. Like, just like last episode, you're stuck in a closet and you're... Nice. Last episode, you're stuck in a closet with one of those things and you're styling on it. And then... And then there's... Why didn't I do that in the first place? Last I didn't realize it was on rail, I guess. Laser eating knife. This episode, I can't even walk upstairs. Yeah. Sir? I need you to put down the bottle. What? How many of them there are down there? There's like four of them, it looks like. Nice job. Not so good now. Okay, maybe that's just two. It's actually like seven, believe it or not. There's three armors and two. Looks like there's two armors and two oh. asshole skellies. Yeah. Skeleton assholes. Which is interesting because an asshole does not have bones. There are no bones involved in the Actually, direction. I'm going to use a spell we haven't used much. What's that? Lingering flame. What's that do? Actually, I don't think we've ever used it. I did. Here's the what's it do? What's it 
the flame ball lingers. <laughs> it's a pretty cool spell, right? <laughs> That's what it says on the tin, I guess. But I kind of want to. This seems like I could set up some goofy firewall traps. Like, oh, run people through the flames over and over. Maybe. This wasn't the way. This is the way. Yeah. Remember when you get up there after also, you get your stuff. Also, I won't do anything else. Okay. This is. We finally found where that comes from. Okay, good. That's kind of disappointing. Yeah, but you know whatever. Say la guerre. Ooh. <laughs> booga booga booga. Didn't have any time for your bullshit. So you gotta get back to the thing. Just me or there's spikes on the other side of that thing. No. Just four. So yes. It's not really. Just, just kinda, like, fakely. Purely for aesthetic design. Not for impaling fools. Gotta go that way first guy gets sold back. You ain't so good in this direction. All of a sudden, set myself on fire. That was beautiful. It didn't happen. Why fight things when the fire bull can do it for me? Come on. human in here at all. I don't know if there's any seven signs in here. I imagine there will be once we're closer to a... Well, sometimes they're just in places to help you with an area. Like Masterless Glencore! <laughs> <laughs> How we used him to kill the entirety of the thing. Trying to aggro the. Not quite, but. I didn't think any bug in the souls back out and then come back. Nice, nice, nice. Get the, the fireball with an arrow and make it come. Door bang. Just keep in mind that there's an asshole skeleton right there. I know. It's weird and uncomfortable and I hate it. Or 
set yourself on fire. Uh, okay. Mimic. That would be the best. Or more smelter wedges. Oh dear, we might not be nearly through with this. Okay, so where's this? Right above it. Right, because you went up. Okay, so now you can go the other way. Yep, so we're just friggin' thing gets here. I like how there's a lot of places of this where it doubles back on itself. Or it's right there. I don't know if it's at the top of the elevator. Yeah. Where is this going? Where to? Somewhere we've already been? Maybe. Dark Spirit Prowlers. There's prowlers. It's a great sword, I think, will get you this really easy. Santiers. That's what I'm going to use. Oh, yeah. That's, that's another reason we were using Santiers, right? Because we get stuff sassy. Also, you don't need the um, Thunderlord ring anymore. Sure. We'll use the Flame Quartz ring. That would have actually been really goddamn smart to be using throughout the year. <laughs> Too bad we're stupid, huh? Yep. And we just upped our int. We doubled it, in fact. Well, you know, we... That allowed us, you know, to make good choices. Perhaps put our shield on the back. Wait a minute. No. Are you gonna set? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Someone set a bust the bomb. So slight problem with the concept of uh, lingering flame. Oh. We have no spells that increased our cast speed. Right. I mean, the way I would do it, honestly, is I would ride the elevator up, and I would cast it right from the elevator, then ride the elevator back down. And cast it again. If you can time it right, you don't ever have to step off the elevator, I guess. Get all four lingering flames off right at the same spot. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Was yeah, it's just I don't know the uh, length of the elevator that well. Yeah, well, it's something to do for when you have time to do some off screen grinding. I have no time for that. <laughs> no, you don't ever need to either. That's right. Now, 
how, where do I go to get to him? Go this way. Sure, yes. Take the left. Okay. Push the other way. Ah. Take to upgrade Santier's more. Twinkle Dye Knight. Oh, you should have probably. Eh. No, 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 no. Think of that's death. Probably. The thing is, it looks like it ought to. Uh, not do the lingering flame trick? Nope. I'm gonna hit him with a sword. into that. Wait, hold on, hold on. Don't use it yet. Okay, never mind. I was giving off a warmth smell. instead of standing there. Huh. I'm just getting shot by arrows. Maybe I should... Ah. No, nah, this is good. Uh, I'll, I'll deal with this. I'll be fine. Alright, we'll try your whole method of hit them with a sword. <laughs> you ought to be able to pull one at a time. Just hit them three times and walk away while they're recovering. Hit them three times. They're dead. As the elevator starts to slow down. Right as soon as I can see the elevator. Or the see the top. <laughs> as soon as you can see the elevator, huh? Yep. The elevator is just standing there. Yep. Okay. Actually, we should go spin souls. Spin souls and come back and do this. I'm just concerned that there's, you know, multiple problems. Yeah, I don't think it's literally infinite. I think it's like on the way up to like the final boss area or something. No. Oh yeah, that's enough for one if not... No, it's enough for one. It's like 19,000 right now to level one. Uh, yeah, but that should be enough to level and repair our pants. Oh yeah, repairing our pants is cheap. How did it cost like 8,000? So. I'll go check and see first. Because we don't have any liquid souls, do we? Nope. Yeah, we're at 20,000. Fire bonus gets higher. Fire defense gets higher. Yeah, we're getting better at fire. We are finally becoming more articulate and less... Uh, completely goddamn stupid. So we're going to jump off the cliffs right now, aren't we? Yep. Uh, Repair weapon slash armor. Yeah. Oh, 188. Okay. That's that's nothing. What are we using for weapons and, or armor right now? Dranglaic. Dranglaic and or Vengo. That's pretty much all we've ever used. 
probably all we're gonna use because there's not enough twinkling titanite to upgrade multiple things. <laughs> yeah, that's true. We do have five titanite chunks, which, hold on. That should be enough to um, get both whips to ten now, finally. Bad, bad. Oh, what'd you just upgrade? The Spyhander. Why? Plus I'll ten Spyhander. Why? If you so you've been talking about it for a no, while. No, it, it has the same moveset as the... Except it's six pounds lighter. And this, this problem's getting upgraded. It's already almost there. I mean, I guess you can go back to the Spyhander again. If we don't need to set stuff on fire. If we don't need to set things on fire, I think it still will do more damage because it does physical and fire. Yes, but there are certain things we don't want to hit with fire damage. I suppose. You know, like all of those exploding dudes. I like hitting the exploding dudes with this. You've never done it! I have done it. Have you? Yeah, I tested it and it nearly killed me. I was oh, like, yeah. that's great. <laughs> I'll check the damage real quick while you're waiting for the opening. Compare that to the spike. 437, 360, 360 plus 112. Yeah, this does. This has better scaling. But B and C is thinner than this. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, that one no longer comes back. I wonder if. I'm betting that if you were human, there would be something to help you out. Don't you judge me. Happily, they don't respawn, so this should actually work. Just aggro one of them. There you go. Kill it. Go reset. <laughs> now go reset. Come on, elevator. Yay! Later, nerds. <laughs> <laughs> this is dumb, and you know it shouldn't work. It's wonderful. There's nothing wrong with this. <laughs> this is everything good about video games. <laughs> the green spell is awesome. We're upping our int more, just to get more fire damage. Oh yeah, that's what we're working on anyway. Also, it increases the damage of the sword. Yep. And it's also upping our dark damage. Wait, does it scale on faith or int? What, the fire? Uh, the sword we're building. Uh, faith. Oh wait, no. Fire. Fire. Wait, no. Does it, it requires faith to wield or int? It requires faith to wield. But there was something we needed int to wield. I think it was the Warlock's hat. Probably. How about we just put a point in faith, point in int, point in faith, point in int? I want to get to uh, some amount of faith, faith to use the basic spells. You mean int? Yeah. What did I say? I said faith. Okay, so yeah, get it 12 then. I need to look through our spells anyway, because I'm sure there's some. Crafting. Yeah, but like, just use basic soul arrow to avoid having to use arrows. <laughs> this is amazing. Hey, if they didn't want such a silly spell, they wouldn't have given me options. Come on, guys. Let's do this yet again. Come on, give me a three for You might get a twofer. Or a threefer, maybe. No, I'm just gonna get one. Yeah, I think you pre they prematurely detonated for some reason. I think you want them just around the corner so that something has to be running around it to get to it, you know? I think they were at the edge of the blast radius when they stop to shoot at you. No! Don't shoot me. Seriously, that one's just got a bow. This one's way less durable than... No, they all had like four hits. And the first one had six. First one took six full hits to kill. Hmm. I know that exploding them was really fun. 
Yeah, that was... <laughs> that's pretty great. Who was that? The bull's like, yeah! Who's a... Look so happy. Who's got two thumbs and is a statue? This, this guy. guy! This is an ominous. Nope. Nope. Totally no. not an elevator fight. Ooh, bonfire. Well, this is a great place to stop this episode. Is it? Yeah. 30 minutes on the, no on the dot. All right. Well, cool things happened. And ah. we're total dickbags. <laughs> All right. Until then, I'm Dr. Tempest. See you next time. Later.